I'll be showing you how you can change the checkout address settings for your Shopify store. So let's dive right into it here. On the left hand side, we want to go down to settings. So this is going to be from your Shopify dashboard after you've already logged in. So settings will be in the bottom left hand corner. So just click on settings. And then from there, you want to find out the checkout setting tab here on the left hand side menu. Just click that and you'll get into the checkout settings. Now from there, what we want to do is customize the customer information section or the address section. So we'll get several settings and toggles we can first select. Do you want to have the customer enter in their full name or we can only require the last name. I'm going to put first and last name here just for shipping purposes. You can also set the company name this is going to automatically be set at don't include. You can set this to optional if you're dealing with more companies as your customer. Next will be address line two. I would recommend putting this as optional here as it's going to add an extra field for customers to enter things in such as their unit number. As if you don't leave it, it's going to put that one address field in. And most times when you order something online, it's going to give you this second option. So as we can see here, it is recommended. And I would make sure that is optional. You can also set the shipping address phone number as to have it an optional, required, or don't include. So really that's it as a what you can customize the Shopify checkout address information as most of this is going to be set in, but it does give you some customization on the fields you ask. So hopefully this video was quick and informative. If you enjoyed it, I would love it so much if you hit that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment as well. Lastly, I want to mention our sponsor Profit Calc, the one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations on how profitable your Shopify store actually is. You can get a variety of different detailed metrics breaking down all your expenses so you can make better business decisions and it's going to sync seamlessly with all your different ad accounts and plenty of cost of goods sold options there's a link in the description to access the shopify app listing you can also find it in the shopify app store by searching profit calc and then looking for this logo in the top left both of which get you access to the 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself so this concludes the video here and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in our next one